Hi guys, so before this video starts, I would just want to say that I would love it if you guys could go over to the I Am Freedom Awards website and vote for me. I made it into the top 20 and I really, really need you guys' votes to get me into the top 10. I would be so incredibly grateful if you could take a minute or 30 seconds out of your day to head over to the website. It will be the first link in the description box. Just click that link, it should take you through to this voting page and I would love it if you guys would vote for me. It would be super, super helpful and yeah, thank you guys so much and I hope you enjoy the video. Hi guys, so today's video is going to be a haul video and I'm pretty sure that I said in one of my previous videos that July was going to be the month of hauls. Oh wait, it's August now, god damn it. Okay, well that just completely ruined what I was about to say. I was about to say, yeah, it's the month of hauls, but I just realised that today is the 1st of August, so that's a lie. I have quite a few things to mention this month, so if this haul is long, I apologise. So the first thing I wanted to mention is actually from a brand called Love Me Beauty, and they sent me over one of their kind of monthly subscription boxes, well it's not actually a box, it's a bag. They did send this to me, but I thought I would just include it in this video, um, they're not paying for me to mention this or anything, um, but you get this cute little bag, I believe the subscription box is £10 a month, and I think how it works is each month you get given like a certain amount of credits, and then you go on their website and you can kind of pick your products um, and each product is kind of a different number of credits and then you can pick your products and yeah you get them in this cute little bag this is the august edit and it's happily it's called the happily everlasting edit and i actually have my own little promotional code which is sof does nails 20 which gives you a discount so the first thing in this little bag is the time miracle cellular repair serum for all skin types and i believe this is for your face i think it's just a little serum and it says on the back a clinically proven concentrate for an active anti-aging care i'm always down for trying anti-aging stuff because i'm already getting wrinkles and i'm only 19 so quite excited to try that one. There is then this which I actually laughed when I read this. I've heard about this before. I think it's supposed to be really really good but I believe this is lip balm but it does say on the box Dr. Lip original nipple balm for lips. I'm not too sure why it's called nipple balm but that, that just made me laugh. But yeah I think this is a lip balm and I'm so excited to try this because I've heard really really good things and I'm pretty sure this is quite expensive to just buy by itself so I'm pretty excited that this is in the bag. There's then two things by Nooks, I think that's how you say it, not 100% sure. This is a scented shower oil that has a golden shimmer in it so you can use this in the shower and it'll make your skin like glow and shimmer. And then there's a miniature little oil which it can go on your face, your body and your hair and again this is kind of like golden and shimmery and I think if I put this like through my hair it will make my hair shine and I'm quite excited. Another one of the brands which I believe you can kind of spend your monthly credits on are Eco Tools. I think Eco Tools are in the August edit so they sent me over some of the Eco Tools stuff that you can get. So there is a six piece day to night set which has got like a little fan brush and I'm so excited to try these because I've never tried Eco, Eco Tools brushes before. I've always seen them since I've been like younger. I've seen them in boots and like TK Maxx and stuff but I've never actually tried them so that is one of the sets there's then a six piece starter set which has basically got like a powder brush and then a couple of eye brushes and an angled brush and stuff so that's the six piece starter set there's then a five piece travel set and I'm really interested in this one because it's got a miniature kind of like a smoky eye brush and then some powder brushes and a little angled brush and all of these by the way come in a little makeup bag which is like at the back and then there is the six piece essential eye set and this one it just has six different eye brushes of different kind of shapes there's little pencil brushes and stuff in here and then there's ones for kind of like blending and stuff so yeah I think these eco tools little brush sets are so cool another one of the brands is Vita or Vita Liberata and this is a tanning brand so again there's different products that you can get there is the self tanning gradual lotion so this you kind of build up in layers there is then the dry oil self tan with SPF 50 and this kind of protects but it also gives you a little bit of colour as well. And it's got this very bronzed lady on the side. There is then this two to three week tan mousse in the shade medium. And again, it has the bronze lady on the side. There is also this self tanning night moisture mask, which is a gradual build tan and it says suits all skin tones. And then the final thing is just this little tanning mitt. So obviously you can apply your tan. So if you guys are interested, then I will leave all the links down below and everything. And I'll leave the discount code down below as well. Next, I have some clothing items. The first one is what I'm actually wearing right now. This is a t-shirt dress. I don't know if you guys can see, by the way, if you see anything like this, this is like a flash tattoo. Um, but anyway, I got this dress. This is like a t-shirt dress. So it's just a kind of standard t-shirt dress. It's actually a bit long for me. I need to take it up. Um, but yeah, that one looks like this. And it's literally just black and white striped as I 
just showed you and you can see. So this one is from Shein and then the second piece from Shein, you guys will have seen this if you follow me on Instagram but I have literally been wearing this so much because I love it so much. It's this little off the shoulder crop top and it's just white and it sits off your shoulders like this and it's got these beautiful kind of lacy sleeves and this is so, so pretty, so summery. It's the perfect length on me to be like a crop top and it fits me absolutely perfectly. I got both of these in a size small, I believe. And yeah, I just, I'm so in love with this top. The only thing is it's a bit thin so you have to wear like a nude bra under it. You can't really wear a white bra because you can see through it but if, if you wear a nude bra with this, you literally can't see through it and it looks beautiful. So if you guys want to see what this looks like on, obviously I'll put a little try on clip and it is on my Instagram as well. I then got a couple of bits from Romway. The first thing is this elephant little like camisole kind of top thing. It's not a camisole, is it? What is this called? Like a kind of vest top, I guess. And this is just covered in elephants. And as you guys know, maybe you don't, elephants are actually one of my favorite animals. And this one is actually really nice quality. Like compared to some of the other stuff I've had from Romway, this one is a really nice kind of material material is quite thin but then it's not like see-through thin I don't know it just feels really nice and I just thought this was so cute and it has a little kind of keyhole bit at the back with a little gold button here and I think this was just in one size it doesn't seem to have a size label on it but I'm pretty sure it was just in one size so I'm really really happy with that one I think I'm gonna get a lot of use out of this I then got two kind of like crop top or bralette things and this first one is already covered in cat hairs literally anything in this house that is black will get covered in cat hairs so the first thing is this kind of little crossover bralette thing and this is very similar to a bikini that I have from misguided but this is just in kind of like a t-shirt form and this actually does have padded cups which I think is actually quite cool they are removable so obviously if you don't want them you can take them out but it's just a little kind of stretchy like crop top thing and yeah I think this is pretty cute I then got another kind of bralette crop top thing and this one is just white again this one has removable cups which I actually quite like I think I will keep them in on this one because obviously something of this kind of shape is quite difficult to wear a bra with the only thing that kind of is annoying about this one is wait where is it one of these bits here is like way too long. I'm pretty sure it's on this side. Um, I might just sew it up myself, but when you put it on, it looks a bit odd. I'll, you'll see what I mean on the try on clips, but like this bit is just kind of, it just kind of like dangles and looks a bit strange. So that's the only thing that's wrong with this one. And then also with the black one, part of it hasn't been like sewn together properly. It doesn't really like lie flat. So I don't know. They're not the greatest quality, but they're quite cute. So I then got a pair of shoes. And if you guys follow me on Snapchat, you would have seen these. I got these from New Look. I know that some people are going to absolutely hate these. Some people will probably quite like them. But I got these in New Look. They are just little heeled kind of, I don't really know what these are, like kind of, boots but sandals at the same time they just tie up and they're like a tan color and obviously they've got this heel and these I believe were reduced to like 22 pounds or something from like 29.99 they had like a certain amount of money off I got these to wear to the live color event that I went to because I needed some kind of summery heels that weren't too kind of dressy for the event because I'm only five foot two and I always get really self-conscious about turning up to things and people thinking I'm 12 so I needed a pair of heels and I know that's really bad Obviously, I could have just worn flats, but I really wanted to get some heels, so I didn't feel so self-conscious. So I got these, and I absolutely love them. I then got two pairs of sunglasses, and I think I might have shown these on Instagram, possibly on Snapchat. I don't really 100% remember. Both of these are from ASOS, but they are by the brand Key Australia, which is obviously, like, massive at the moment. And both of these pairs were on sale. They come in a cute little, like, bag thing that you can, like, squeeze the top and then it, like, opens, yeah. The first pair that I got, I believe, are called Avalon. And these ones just look like this. They are kind of cat eye. And both of the pairs that I got are the same kind of, like, reflective colours. So these ones kind of reflect, like, pink and yellowy orange, kind of. I don't really know if it's actually picking up on camera, but yeah, I absolutely love these. They just look like this. Um, I know that some people might think these look a bit ridiculous, but to be honest, I don't really care. I know my boyfriend like hates these. He thinks I look crazy and most people don't really like them that much, but I personally think they're awesome and I don't know, I've been really into sunglasses recently, so this is the first pair I got. I believe they were reduced to like £14, which is amazing. And then the second pair I got are the My Girl sunglasses, and these ones are just black. Um, they're kind of, they're not like solid black. 
I don't really know if you can tell, but they've kind of got this um, sort of pattern on them. These ones just look like this, and again, I know they're very kind of like love it or hate it. I personally love them, I think they look really cool and kind of out there, and yeah, I don't know, I just think they're really, really cool. And I just really liked the colours that they reflected, I don't know, I thought they were quite pretty, so I think these ones were £24. Then moving on to like beauty bits, I got the MUA Skin Define Matte Perfect Loose Powder. I got this in Superdrug the other day because one of my subscribers actually recommended this to me on Twitter. She said that she swears by it and this is literally just a loose powder. However, I tried this the other day and unfortunately it is too dark for me. It just made me look a bit orange, so I think I'm going to be selling this on Depop because I've literally used it once. Then finally I got some bits from the body shop and they were lovely enough to send me some bits and pieces. So the first thing I've used in a video before, this is the Insta Glow CC Cream which has SPF 20 in it. This is more of a kind of moisturiser, it personally for me doesn't give me any coverage it just kind of gives a little glow to your skin and obviously it has the SPF protection in it which is always good the next thing is the down to earth palette and I really want to do like a tutorial on this because I saw Velvet Ghost mention this in her video she did like an eye look with it or something and it was really pigmented so so this is what the colors look like they're all just kind of earthy tones I guess that's why it's called the down to earth palette good one so and these are actually pretty cool because I think you can kind of pop them out the back like they have all these bits on here and you can actually pop them out but I don't have any kind of individual palettes that I could pop them into so I'm not gonna do that I'm just gonna leave it like this but I think the idea is you can kind of like mix and match the different palettes if you have more than one this is what the palette looks like close up so there's some shimmers in there and there's some mattes as well so I just swatched them all on my arm and they are actually really pigmented so if you guys want to see a video of me like using this maybe in like a get ready with me or some kind of makeup tutorial I don't know then just let me know down below there is then two of the best smelling things I have ever smelled in my life. I'm not even joking. These smell amazing. This is the Panita Colada collection and I know that Zoella talked about these in one of her favourite favorites videos a couple of weeks ago and this is the shower gel and unfortunately mine was broken in the post and it had like leaked everywhere which was such a shame but I did manage to put another lid on it so it's still going strong. I lost a bit but it's okay and if I could get you guys to smell this you would die. Like seriously, you need to go into a body shop shop, shop shop, and smell this because it smells so good. So this is the shower gel and then the body sorbet is kind of like a moisturizer and this sinks in really fast. I've been loving this for using on my legs just after I've shaved and the smell really lasts. Like when you put this on, you just smell like a delicious like fruit cocktail and it just smells incredible. Then the final things are part of the tea tree collection and I've been using this one in the shower. I've had to take it out the shower for this video, same with that uh, shower gel as well. And this is the tea tree three in one wash, scrub and mask. So this is basically a kind of grainy sort of facial scrub, but it's not like harsh or anything because I have really sensitive skin and often with kind of exfoliating things, my skin can get quite sensitive, but I haven't had any issues with this. I actually use this on my face and also so like down my neck and onto like my chest and shoulders um, and yeah I've really been enjoying this so far and then finally they sent me a tiny little bottle of their tea tree oil as well and tea tree oil is supposed to be really good to put on your spots like directly onto your spots I wonder if there's any directions for this it says on the bottom suitable for blemished skin so you can literally put tea tree oil on your spots and it's supposed to help them I actually want to try this myself so yeah I think that is everything that is in this month haul and I know it's been a pretty long one it's been a pretty random one but I hope you guys have enjoyed it anyway so if you have enjoyed this video make sure you give it a thumbs up also if you aren't ah, i just bit my cheek also if you aren't subscribed to my channel already i would love it if you would subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video bye